got a first gen ram and we've got a stuck hub bearing we need to reuse this hub so i'll show you how to get it out we use a steering system and i've got the bolts on the back of the hub backed out they are finger tight but off of the hub they're into the hub uh, i don't know a couple threads three four threads so what we're going to do is I'll place this T-handle between the steering knuckle and the bolt, and we'll use hydraulic pressure of the steering system to push it out. Okay, fire it up. Okay, go towards the, towards the driver's side. Okay, back towards the ditch. Now we're free. So here's after I pushed on the nuts here, or on the bolts on the back side. See, it's virtually ready to fall out now. And so the reason I did this is because I'm changing the drive axle U joint. I need to save this bearing. The bearing uh, is worth a couple of hundred dollars. There's nothing wrong with it. If I was to pound on that rotor um, with a steel hammer to potentially damage the rotor. The rotor is seized to the hub, so we're taking it off all in one piece. And um, why we pushed on those back nuts is just so we could save all of this stuff and keep the cost down for the customer. We live in an extreme, uh, an extreme area, a rust belt, as they call it. We get temperatures of minus 35 to minus 40 and upwards of 30 degrees and this is celsius 30 degrees celsius 35 celsius plus so we have a huge variance for heating and uh, expanding and contracting with metals which causes corrosion plus we live in very high uh, snow area so we got a lot of salt and stuff on our roads cause corrosion everything gets locked up so we have to find ways to get by it in order to keep the cost down for the customers I hope this video helped you guys. Um, if there's any questions, please comment. If you like the video, hit the like. And if you like to see more quick solutions to save money, save parts, hit that subscribe button and comment what you want to see and I'll upload some more content. Thank you very much.